first I want to introduce myself and my name is Sean Skelton and I'm very real and unfortunately this is also very real. I didn't know what else to do other than to just come on live and show everybody what my body is going through at all awakening hours of my day. I don't know what's happening to my body, okay? It's a good question to me as it is for you, but I know that on Monday, I was a very functioning person, zero medical issues at work every day. I got the COVID vaccine, the Moderna, on January the 4th. On Tuesday, I had mild flu-like symptoms. I went to work. Um, stomach pains and diarrhea some, you know, Wednesday, I wasn't feeling good. I wasn't able to go to work. My tongue began to spasm out of control. By Thursday morning, I was in full body convulsions. I'm Ravana and welcome back to Rebel HQ. That woman, Sean Skeleton, posted a video of her shaking and gyrating to Facebook, claiming that it was caused by the COVID vaccine. However, PolitiFact did some investigative research and found out that although she did go to the hospital for her symptoms, none of the tests they ran, MRI, CT scans came back with any answers, and the CDC made a statement saying they are not common or even known among people who have side effects from the vaccine. Her doctor also told her that her symptoms were likely a result of stress and not at all related to the vaccine. So without a shred of evidence, she's attributed her shaking to the vaccine. And she's far from the only one. Let's calm down. A little bit. Just fit me of it. Uh, There's no sense of holding me. It doesn't help. That was a video of Angelia DeSell from Louisiana claims that her shaking was also caused by the vaccine, although there's no information to verify that. And a spokesperson for the CDC told PolitiFact in an email that the agency has, quote, no adverse event data regarding a case of this nature out of Louisiana. But why would people lie about this, you might be wondering? Well, this next video might give us a little insight into that. This woman whose hand is miraculously steady as she picks up and sets down her can of Heineken is Carolina Bork out of Louisiana, who claims that she's been shaking since she got the COVID vaccine 22 months ago. And here is her GoFundMe where she's raised $2,363 to apparently help her heal from her, quote, vaccine injury. Now she's making money off her little videos, but not everybody is. So why else would people pretend to be having these symptoms? Well, some of them are trying to spread fear about the safety of the COVID-19 vaccines without evidence, but some of them I don't think are faking. Some of them have just gotten themselves so worked up with fear over what might happen as a result of the vaccine that once they were vaccinated, they're stressed themselves out into believing that they're having these symptoms. That is referred to as the nocebo effect. But as far as the shaking is concerned, public health officials say there is no link between uncontrollable shaking and the COVID-19 vaccine. 